what is that state of a relationship with the Black Lives Matter Seattle King County crew? How is that relationship uh, for you as the chief of, of police? I've actually have because of my uh, my probably years of of outreach and experience. I mean, I've done this for so long in communities of color. Like I've I've focused my efforts on you know working on youth violence prevention issues, um, demographic outreach. It's kind of interesting. I um, Prior to this job, I, I was actually going to University of Washington, and I was majoring in American Ethnic Studies, Chicano Studies, to focus on. And so never did I think that that was actually going to be applied in my head into this line of work. I didn't think I was going to be a police officer. So then, then I, you learn all sorts of race issues. And then growing up as, as a young Latino um, in Orange County, um, experiencing a variety of different things in, in that, to then now be up here as the chief, like, I've taken a lot of that experience um, that I had, a lot of even just understanding the distrust and mistrust with, with police issues. And I can talk, I mean, back in the day, I, my, my family would talk about the Zoot Suit riots and, you know, because my grandpa was involved in that. Um, I mean, they, we could talk about some of the history of, of you know, being part of deportation and um, because we had, there were immigration issues and, you know, at a time where literally, you know, people were, some of these like ITT tech would, you know, they were doing piecemeal work and then they would get raided out and some of our family would get deported even though they were actually born in the States. I mean, so there was a variety of different things that I think in my head, like, like how do I address these issues? How do I bring stuff into my forefront as a police chief to figure out how do I change policing? And, and so all of this comes into the effect of, of where George Floyd is, to now my, my style of leadership of what I actually want to get out of this department and how I want to actually lead this department. You know, I, I, the, m all the relationships in the community uh, groups, BLM, Urban League, I've had those well, well established. In fact, I ran many programs with many of those groups, um, whether it was on uh, critical incident response, it was, you know, trying to keep kids from getting shot and so I've already had those development of those relationships. Um, and, and that's what, that to me is what some of the benefit that I'm trying to get our officers to understand about how important it is to be actively engaged in community. 